Hi and welcome to December's Messy Church in a Bag. We're really glad that you could join us. Today is probably going to be a story you've heard before and I bet you can guess which story that is. But what you might not know is that there was a fox who saw the whole thing and it's going to be him telling us the story of the very first Christmas. The Fox's Tale. Jesus is born. Hello, I'm a fox. I live out on the hills. I sleep by day and hunt by night. If you're lucky, you might see me on a hilltop against the moon. But don't blink or I'll be gone. Here's my story. I'll make your tail bristle. Listen. Listen. Two nights ago, I'm up on the hill near the town. The night is cold and clear. I lift my head and sniff the air. The scent of sheep is everywhere. There's another smell too that halts me in my tracks. The shepherd's out, and by my nose, more than one. That means the sheep are lambing. I skirt around the hill, then wait a while and listen. Somewhere up ahead, a lamb is calling to its mother. Crouching low and keeping to the bushes, I follow. Now I can see it clearly, sitting in the long grass. A speckled lamb, not one week old. Suddenly, a blinding flash sends me running into the bushes. Shaking to my toes and blinking in the light, I freeze. Across the hill, a golden glow has fallen. And coming from the sky, the sound of singing. All at once... The air is filled with shining men. I'm scared. I cannot smell these men. They have no scent. One of them is speaking to the shepherds. Do not be afraid, he says. We bring good news. Great joy has come to all of you. Today in Bethlehem, a baby has been born. He is your promised king, your saviour. You'll find him lying in a cattle trough. Quickly! Run and see. Suddenly, the shining men are gone. The sound of singing dies away. The shepherds stare at one another, and then all talk at once. They laugh and shout. They jump and clap their hands. Then off they run towards the town to find the baby king. I follow on behind. I'm wary of the town. It's full of sounds and smells I do not know. But I would like to see this baby king. Keeping to the shadows, I watch the shepherds disappear inside a stable. Behind the stable is a high fence. Without a sound, sound, I'm up and over it. My luck is in. There's light streaming through a crack in the back of the wall. From here, I can see everything. Inside are cows and sheep and goats. It's odd. They know I'm here, but they're not afraid. There are people too, a woman and a man, and by the door the shepherds. All of them are looking at a cattle trough, lit by a lantern. And there, just as the shining men had said, a newborn baby sleeps, a king in a cattle shed. His mother smiles and lets the shepherds and tells the shepherds to come in. Quietly they stand and watch. The baby murmurs in his sleep. His name is Jesus, the woman says softly. One of the shepherds takes something out of his cloak. It's a speckled lamb, a present for the baby. He gives it to the woman, then bends close to see the baby's face. The shepherd's smiling face glows in the light, and just like the shining men, he has seen a king and so have I. Not many shepherds or foxes can say that. The shepherds whisper their goodbyes and leaves. My belly tells me that I too must be making tracks. It's a harsh winter and life is hard for a fox. And for you too, little king, it seems. I wish you well. I hope the lamb will keep you warm. Sweet dreams. Let us pray. Lord God, thank you for the fun and excitement of Christmas. Thank you for the good news of the birth of a baby, Jesus, your son. 
a gift sent out of love from you to our world. As we sing our carols, may they remind us of the hope Jesus showed. As we open our presents, may we be reminded that Jesus was and is the best present ever. Help us to share the good news of Jesus to our world. Amen. I hope you've enjoyed the story and I hope you've joined in with the prayer and are looking forward to all the lovely activities in your bag. Jesus is the best ever Christmas present and the great news is that he's still a present for us today. Jesus is with us at all times, at Christmas and every single day. And just like the angels said, that's really good news. Our next Messy Church in a Bag is going to be on January the 17th, so we hope we'll see you then too. And the only thing I've got to say now is, Merry Christmas! Yeah.